Yes, Rakesh, how can I help you? yeah uh yeah uh i'm currently working as a cloud and devops engineer in clarion technologies Mm -hmm. uh since uh seven years um Okay. previously i was working as a technical support engineer in a system admin domain Mm -hmm. and I, when i joined Clarion, and then i switched to the aws cloud and uh right Uh, now I'm looking for the job change. What sort of activities do you perform? Uh, what what kind of your day-to-day -day work look like? Is uh, handling client AWS infrastructure, CI/CD pipeline implementation, monitoring, observability. Mm -hmm. That kind of work I'm doing, providing infra information to the new client. Which is good, right? This is this is good hands-on uh, kind of experience. Shouldn't be Yes. a struggle. A lot of companies Uh, are looking no. for this kind of uh, stuff. Oh, pardon me. A lot of companies are going through this uh, process. They need these this these skills. Urgently. So, what is the issue? Uh, the issue is uh, when I join interview, then I'm I'm unable to deliver the what what's in my mind. And suppose interviewer asks me, uh, uh, what's your approach for the, uh, the some issue is going on to the live server. But then I know what I have to do by need to check logs and that all stuff. But I can't deliver that things. But why? Uh, If that you is know, what if you, I am wondering. if you know it, um, and you have done it, Yeah. then you should be telling it, you should actually be going beyond what you would typically do, because in your company, you sometimes you know that, okay, this would have failed. Uh, but for a new company, you would ask, uh, uh, so practice about it, right? Practice, do some mocks if you want to. I conduct mocks uh, so many times I open out open uh, slots for mock interviews. Okay. So Okay. it's And just all a matter of things. practice. That's Mm -hmm. Okay. because if you do a mock with someone, they will tell you that do you really there are gaps in your understanding, in your learning, or anything, or is it just confidence related stuff and you know about it? Try to do mocks with people you know and people um, your mentor or someone around you. They can they can even look at your day to day body language and even based on that they can tell you that actually you you are lying and you don't know about it so you should study uh, that could Okay. be a, a feedback or they will say Rakesh you do this we have done this activity in our job this is how we do it why don't you talk about that use case why don't you talk about that language here Okay. so that Okay. could these And uh... these are some of the approaches these few things you can take. Uh, uh, and then obviously those standard things like are you certified uh, have you done some certifications and all they give you a lot of use cases they give you a lot of scenario based questions so you know even on things that you would have not worked on you can you get some knowledge Okay. have you done some certifications Okay. Yeah, I am the uh, I have done the AWS Solution Architect Associate. mm -hmm. go next level do professional level Okay. Okay. That will give you so many questions, scenarios, and what to do in those scenarios kind of thing. And Okay. once you know, then I I believe, first thing is to know, and being then second is being able to answer it. Your problem is, is a good problem that you know about things, you are not able to del deliver it. It would be a bigger problem if, if you really don't know, then you have to learn and then deliver. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. And uh, another thing is, uh, so uh, I'm limited to the some services like uh, uh, Kubernetes, Docker, and, uh, you know, uh, AWS means there's uh, I utilizing day to day the limited resources. So uh, Right. there is uh, no part of Python scripting and not uh, that much in bash scripting, just uh, some kind of small tasks. Uh, that needs to be automated in the bash Mm -hmm. so uh, when i go to the a uh, lot of uh, job descriptions of the uh, different companies they are asking for the multiple skills like go python bash 
power shell so means i'm here lot of confused that uh, every company is uh, asking for the different different skill different so skill set how, yeah so how i can tackle that yeah these are you just mentioned about some of the scripting side of it there would be different tools they would be using github actions yeah you may not be using github actions yes they may be using gitlab uh, they right may be they may not be using shell scripting and bash and all this uh, they yeah may be using ansible so okay uh, and then so many other complexities because of this so uh, you have to learn them there is no shortcut okay now you you don't have to learn all of them with the same uh, depth but you have to still learn at least an overview of it at least uh, mm how you would do it certain things in in gitlab versus github actions or what what are the -hmm. differences so you have to do that uh, a, a bit of uh, thing that's why i because you are in my whatsapp group we do 12 projects so we what we have done is we have gone through these uh job descriptions hundreds of job descriptions and then we have created certain projects that okay if you do these then you will be covering some of uh, some of your even then uh, companies started asking bit of ai or as well uh, so all that we keep adding to that so that's that's what i would suggest i'm not saying you should do the projects uh, that we offer you should you will have to do at least a hello world in powershell a hello world if your core uh scripting is uh something else then you will have to be aware how to write something in python how to write serverless function in python so you have to Okay. do that don't have to, to go to the depth of your favorite language or your favorite scripting or your favorite tool but you have to be aware because otherwise you will not be able to target those job descriptions Okay. and you will you can confidently say that yes i know this i know how this is done and i can use copilot or i can use some of the ai tools to do this in a powershell or if needed so you can give that sort of confidence if you have not worked on it uh, in detail uh, so that could be an approach Okay. Okay. at That's seven good. years at your level yes they would expect uh, a depth and and the vast uh, the the length and breadth of devops and cloud space Okay. Okay, good. Yeah. Uh, I think uh, I'm good. I get cool it. Uh, <laughs> yeah. all right best of luck do reach out uh, you have my number if you need any help Sure, sure. okay Absolutely. sure thanks man Okay. bye Thank you.